Hey guys, 681 Shadow, welcome to another video on Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle Wrong uh, JP here. And we have an interesting showcase for you guys. Yes, you do see this correctly. We are showing off Extreme AGL on the channel today. Not not because I like sure I have I've had a bunch of these units already, like Super 17, I had the Rose, I had the Bojack, but I pulled this guy yesterday from the day I'm um, recording this. I pulled him on Saturday. I should be putting this up on like Monday or Tuesday, something like that. But we did pull LR Monte Vegeta, so I decided to do a Yolo single on his banner, and I ended up getting him, which was really awesome. So we got him SA20, uh, plus 2,000 all stats. So we're gonna be trying out, um, we'll be trying out a um, Extreme AGL team, seeing how it works. We're going on Boss Rush uh, Stage 5, just so we can, just so just so um, I can see what this team can do. So we can see type advantage, um, disadvantage, all that fun stuff, and. Shout out, shout out to a guy on my Discord server for um, getting, sending his friend to uh, Super 17 here. If you guys want to join my Discord server, um, definitely do that. Definitely do that. It's in um, the link to that is in the description down below. We have some cool, cool guys that play Dokkan, so like if you're if you're like me and you want to run uh, a team like this at some point, you there are people there. So definitely, if you need leaders, you can go there. And we're just gonna jump right into this. We probably won't get through the whole um, boss rush just because this team is uh, sort of slow starting. So, alright, so our rotations are not the best at the beginning here. We're definitely going to have to polish those up. So we're starting off with Super Saiyan 4 Goku. We should be, we should be able to do this event relatively well. So we're going in. Uh, let's see. And as we do this, I'm going to sort of explain the team. I'm going to... Who do I want to rotate out? Um, let's actually let's rotate out of the 7. Yeah, we'll keep mine with you guys. Okay, so the options for this team, I know it's not the most optimal, but basically just stuff I have um, sitting around what sitting around. So well well not really sitting around. These are like really my best options. Like I'll definitely replace stuff when I get um, better options for the team. But right now we have uh, both our Super 17s are SA10, um, no dupes in them, with the maximum amount of orbs in the dupe system. So they're all so they're definitely really, they're definitely all good. It's not like any of them are um, any of the Super 17s are really bad. So that is a good thing. Then we have uh, Monster Vegeta, which is which Monster Vegeta is pretty solid. So we have um, we have the suit, we have the uh, Golden Freezer. Golden Freezer is a really solid tank. Um, I believe if you have is that a cert he um, reduces I think 90% of damage dealt at um, at a certain like percentage of HP. Let me, let me actually see if I can pull up this card. If I can, if it'll tell me the number. Let's see. Uh, yeah, when HP is 50% or above, it re he, re he mitigates 90% damage, which is really good. So we are going to Bojack. We'll have Bojack there. Bojack will eventually rotate off, but I want to get one of these in rotate, um, rotating off our, right from the start here. So the thing about these um, Super 17 cards is that they're very that they are kind of slow because um, as a lot of you probably know, they have to get hit to um, to increase their damage. So Bojack getting super tanky here, which. This isn't the best, but he's not doing that much to him. So, alright. So right now he's only doing 318k. He hasn't gotten hit at all, so it sort of makes sense that his damage is kind of low right now. But see, as he gets hit, his damage is get, he's gonna get um, increased even more, which he did get hit, which is um, he's pretty good. So one rotation, we're gonna have uh, Super 17, and we have the Super 17 and the uh, and the uh, and other Android 17. And then in our other rotation, which we have right here, we're going to have Maja Vegeta, and we're going to have uh, Rose Goku Black. So let's see. Okay, one of them's not getting a super attack. We're actually gonna um, not have Vegeta get a super attack. We'll, we'll let Rose get a super attack here. Maja Vegeta has Maja Vegeta has high defense because he's an LR, so we'll be able to uh, take these just fine. Yeah, double digit damage, absolutely fine here. We probably won't get through all of Boss Rush due to this being such a um, slow starting team. But we'll get through, um, we'll probably do the first two or first three stages of this one. I don't want this to be an excessively long video. And now our rotations are perfect, so we have the two androids together. Uh, we're gonna have you get those orbs. Now he's, and he has some hits over there, so this, um, this android um, 17 is actually probably gonna get to max damage here. Which would be really cool to see. So we're gonna see his, we're gonna see his stat go up a, a lot more. Which is really good, and he, and I'm pretty sure he, he gets um he, he does get a few links with the uh, Android 17 up there. Good partner for him. And now hitting for a million on uh, the great ape there. 
So that's very solid. Now we're back to our Saiyans, where we're fighting the Goku here. Alright, we're going to... Yeah, we're going to attack um, with Majin Vegeta there, Rose is there, and Super 17 there. I wonder, I wonder if we'll actually be able to... Actually, we might be able to beat this in this first turn, now I'm thinking about it. He's going to super attack us, let's see how much that does to Majin Vegeta with the, uh, on the 120 team. It does only 42k, okay, that's not, that's not that bad. Like, this is my first time actually seeing Majin Vegeta on a team like this, because I've only really seen him on the, um, on his 90% team, because I've seen him on Global. But he's definitely very solid in this game. He he's definitely one of the best choices that you do have him. If you don't have him, it doesn't it's um not the end of the world, because there are other there are other um great choices for this team. I really wish I had I had Super 17 on my team, because that would also be amazing. And we won turn to the Super Saiyan 4 Goku event with this team, so not even bad. Let's go on to the uh Vegeta event here. Which I'm forgetting what the um what the link is for Vegeta. I don't think it's GT. So, we're not going to completely, like, obliterate Vegeta. So, we're going to go here. We'll have, uh... Well, yeah, we'll have Super 17 take those. And... I'm actually liking this team so far. Like, like sure, it's, it's sort of, uh... It's sort of slow, because you have to get hit multiple times. But, like, he's already... He's already hitting there for almost, um... For almost 500k without getting hit once with the list. So, he's... He's doing pretty good. This guy isn't gonna hit for that hard, for that hard though. He has no orbs in him, so it sort of makes sense. And this freeze is not meant to hit hard at all. This freeze is just a really good tank. I feel like this team, if I if I were to beef it up more, it might do um, might do decently in Super Battle Road. If I was able to beef up this team a little more, maybe get Bojack out for a um, for a better for a um, better unit. But Bojack was really like the last thing I had for this team, so it is what it is. Okay, he'll get a place. He'll get replaced eventually. I really only have him, um, I really only use his Bojack otherwise for my, um, for my, uh, LR Bojack on the going to see. So, this is nice damage there, 2.2 million. I love, I'm loving Majin Vegeta on this team. This, like, I feel like this team is very underrated, but this team has a lot of good options. Alright, so we have the friend, and we have mine, neither have been hit. We're actually gonna do this, just so, cause I know we're not gonna kill him this turn, so I'll let mine get hit by, um, by the Vegeta there. So we'll give you those, and we'll give my Super 17 those, and he, this one has a super attack, but that, that's alright, he's, he's the floater one, so, he, so he's not going to have too many chances of uh, doing damage for us. Our main damage dealers, for, for, like, like, I feel like the reason that this team is working fairly well for me is because we have, um, because we have our two rotations where one of them is, is slow starting, which is this one, and then my other rotation already has two very good damage dealers, so. They're not struggling whatsoever here. So, as I say, they're not struggling. One of them's not going to get a super attack. So that's really important. So we got sacrifice. Uh, I sacrifice Mach to the super attack yet again, and give that to Jose. And we actually, can we can actually get a Dokkan mode, can we? Oh no, we can't. We ju we just miss out on the Dokkan mode. Okay, so we'll see us. We'll see a Dokkan mode with uh, super 17. We get we do get an additional there though, so not even bad. Yeah, so we'll we'll get the Dokkan mode with uh, super Android 17. On this, either this one or the strength one, depending on if Rose can kill him, which I don't think so. Yeah, no, unless he gets the additional system, which he doesn't, which is perfectly fine. We'll be able to uh, be able to see how a Dokkan mode from uh, Super 17 will do. So we're gonna go right here. Yeah, we have, we definitely have enough um, orbs to get a super attack. We have the Dokkan mode. His attack's gonna get increased a little more with the damage, so that's definitely really good. We're gonna see how much he can do with a couple hits, and he's only been hit a couple times. So, it's not gonna be like the max power, but this will definitely do a decent amount. Let's see if I can hit all these that I am on emulator. So one, two, three, four, five, six, there we go. At first when you start doing this in emulator, it's really hard to click all of those, but as you keep doing it, it gets better. So, our his stats, his stats almost 800k. So, that's really solid. Let's see, he'll probably hit for at least a million. I know he can't crit, so it'll probably be like a million. So, like a million. Yeah, 1.1 million. That's solid. And we should have a decent amount of health back from that. Yeah, it a decent amount of health back. Now we're on this now we're on this phase where we'll probably just one turn this. We have Majin Vegeta. And I'm not really focusing I'm focusing more so on the uh, Super 17 um, instead of the Majin Vegeta because I do I do already have a showcase up of the Majin Vegeta on my global. Exactly the same potential potential stats and uh, super attack level on the global showcase. So if you guys want to see that, check out my global Dokkan playlist. That should be in the description of this video. 
So I really want this to be mainly about the, um, the I mean, I want, I want it to mainly be about the uh, Super Saiyan Okay, so now we're against Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. This will definitely be interesting. So we'll have that. Actually, you can just take those two. And we're gonna save, we're gonna, we're gonna save some orbs for, um, we're gonna save orbs for the next rotation. And we're, alright, we're getting hit. Super 17 is a, um, pretty decent tank though, so... Yeah, 69k from that attack. It did lower my defense though, so it's a little unfortunate. And now the attack says one, is almost 1.1 mil, which is really good. So Super 17 is starting to really output damage now, and he's a, he's at max, which won't, which about 1.1 million is pretty solid in, in and of itself. Even if it's not like the greatest thing in the world, it's still um, solid. Now I'm gonna have to pop an item here, since it, it, this is a 120 team, so it's not going, it's not like it's a um, like a complete one shot team for these events. So definitely do keep that in mind. So actually, I should have switched Monster Vegeta Rose. That was not. That was not smart on my on um, my end, but maybe we'll be able to knock him out here with uh, Majin Vegeta's super and then Rose's. And he, actually, no, he's gonna super attack Majin Vegeta. That's fine. That's actually really, that's actually fine. He does 122k though, which is a lot. Majin Vegeta does a lot of damage. And we have Gohan. Can he be stunned? I actually don't remember. It's been it's been a while since I've done the Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta. I don't actually remember if he can be stunned or not. But we're actually getting close to killing him. We we didn't stun though. Even, even if he can be stunned, we didn't stun. Yeah, I, I, I should have switched the two of them so Majin Vegeta could take him. Uh, could have taken less damage to all the attacks there. All right. All right. We got those there. Those there. Yeah. All right. And we're gonna heal. Actually, no. We're gonna Yama. We'll be able to live super attack if we Yama. Without a doubt. I'm actually not sure if this an of uh, this Android 17 is passive, the um, the regular 17. I'm gonna actually look it up right now while um, while we're going through this. Probably should have been a little more prepared, but it is what it is. We're gonna go into the cooler event now, and after the cooler event, we'll, we will end off the video. So we'll see how it does against this last event here. And we're definitely gonna heal this first turn. Too bad we can um, get a Dokkan mode on the first turn of cooler, because that would have definitely been helpful. It would have definitely helped us to get a Dokkan attack here, but. But, we'll make do with what we have. Alright, so we'll kill... Alright, so uh, Vegeta will attack uh, Salsa. Then, Rosé will attack... Uh, probably Naze. But we're gonna, um, we're gonna heal. And let's search up Android 17. I'm looking this up on my phone, just because it's the easiest way to look it up. Alright, then we have Frieza. Frieza could just take that, sure. Let's see the, um... I believe it's Hellfighter 17. I might be wrong. I might be the other one. If it wants to look. Okay, it doesn't want to load on here, apparently. Alright, I'm going to look up on my computer. It's taking too much time. Alright. Alright, so yeah, so we did take them both out. Just, just as I predicted we would. So, we'll just finish off, uh... Hopefully, try to finish off Dore. Right? I doubt we'll be able to though on this turn, just just because he's uh, just because he's tech. But he should be the last tech opponent we have to deal with here. All right, Android 17. Let's look at that 17. Okay, okay, yeah, it's just 17. That's not that's not Hellfighter. Hellfighter is the Iron Demon. Okay, additional attack. Okay, okay, the 17 is a support. Uh, AGL and INT type 2 plus 2 and attack and defense plus 25%. So he's actually very solid. So, not only is he, is he giving those good links, but he's also being a support for, um, for, um, my, for my Super 17, which is really good. Alright. Wait, now, is this enough for the final explosion? Actually, no, no, that is 17 key. So, that's really good. Alright, and then you can get orbs too. Maybe we'll be able to, um, maybe we'll be able to Dokkan attack, um, maybe we'll be able to get Dokkan attack against the, against the final form cooler and see how, see what we can do with that. Because Final Form Cooler hits hard. Like, they, they, like, whatever, like, no matter, like, most of the stuff you're using, you will get, like, no matter what it is, you'll get hit hard by the Cooler. Alright, so we have that. He's gonna get hit a few times there by Cooler, which is nice. Then, gonna save those, we're gonna save those AGL orbs. And, uh, wait for, and see, um, see if we actually, um, 
Yeah, see if we can take out the cooler here. Alright, six six point eight K. Which is kinda sad. <laughs> no, let's see, six K. Almost like seven K damage for Actually that's not bad. Well that's bad for him, good for us. Like, Super 17 he he's definitely a very solid unit. I don't know why like a lot of the villain cards aren't like used that much. He didn't tank though, but that makes sense. He's not built to tank. But that freeze is built to tank though. Alright, so let's get let's get Salsa out of here. With you. Yeah, focus on Salsa. And then we'll put and then the rest of our attacks will go into I'm sh I think we'll be able to take them out both we'll take them both out this turn. Majri will be able to take out Salsa and um then Rose will take out um Core. I think. Did we take out Salsa? We did, awesome. Now we're on to AGL Core. Oh, and the crit from Rose. I do have a dupe in my Rose. Sadly, it's in top left and not bottom right, but once I pull another AGL Rose, I'll be able to uh, get that. Okay, let's do... Actually, this is, this is fine. Because, um, Super 17 getting cl getting cl pretty close to uh, being maxed. So, that's definitely very solid. We should be able to live this turn, no problem. So, I, I, I don't see this turn being too much of an issue. 37k, yeah, we're not doing too much damage. We're not quite at max yet, but we're get, we're getting very close. And that's gonna do okay, 500k. Get the support. I'm actually not 100% sure if the LR Android or this um, Android 17 is a better is a better linking unit for Super 17, but um, but this one is still doing very good. I'm not I'm not sure when I'll um, when I'll do the LR Android grind on JP. I did miss the campaign, so I'm not really sure when I'm going to want to do that. Alright, so we have Rosé there. Yeah, we'll be fine this turn. Because Majin, Majin Vegeta won't take too much damage. And then we'll, we'll definitely heal against uh, Final Form Cooler, though. That, that's not a question. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we, we were definitely fine this turn. And then. Rose will go there and finish him off. So, final boss of the video now. We got the final form cooler. Let's get right to that. All right. Oh yeah, we definitely want to heal first and foremost. And we're going to actually the, his, the majority of his attacks are against 17. So. We should be fine to not use them. Well. And then we'll save those blue orbs for the next for the next turn. Still doing 7k for it to me though. That's a lot. On the normal type. Well, cooler does hit for a lot. He hits a lot harder than most other uh, most other units in the game. All right, and we're we're max now. We're uh we're at 1.09 mil, or about 1.1. I'm not gonna say 1.09. That's just that's just a little extra. All right, and then. These other two attacks won't really do that much. But this is overall a really good team. If you have friends that have Super 17s, just just try to use him as your um as your lead, because he's honestly a really great card. So I don't know if we'll be able to get this Dokkan mode. I'm gonna Yama here, just to be safe. Because if we don't get the Dokkan here, we'll get the Dokkan uh next turn for sure. Yeah, we don't get it here. So we'll get it next turn with Super 17. If he lives this turn, because I know Majin Vegeta and Rose are about to do a bunch of damage. So let's let's see what happens here. Okay. Ooh, we did stun him though. Oh, oh so that so the that wasted that Yama. That's uh, that's a little that's unfortunate. Yeah, he'll live this turn, and then we'll be able to uh, we'll be able to Dokkan mode him next turn. But we don't we don't have to worry about using items next turn, which is awesome. All right, so. Alright, so we are gonna get this Dokkan mode right here. He is stunned. Alright. So this is this is a great way to end the video here. Definitely. If we went with this event, we probably would lose, because next is the same three angel Goku. And my team my team as it is right now is not um cap is not um at the point where they can take that on comfortably. So it is what it is. We got that Dokkan mode, let's see how much we'll do to this cooler. Damage-wise, because the, the attack says um, about 1.1 mil, 
and we'll see that we are going to end up doing oh, okay almost 1.1 mil even with coolest damage, damage reduction so we're gonna end off the video here guys um, this is definitely a really awesome team if you haven't tried out Super AGL and you have a Super 17 definitely I would recommend trying him out but um, yeah with that I'm gonna end off the video here guys thank you all for watching remember to rate comment subscribe and share and I will see you all next time